What up guys, today we're looking at the Flash Spring, the bat suit, but now let's take a closer look at this box. Starting off at the top of the box, you get DC the Flash, then you get McFarlane Toys in the right corner. For the front of the box, you get DC Multiverse, DC the Flash, the Flash. For the right side of the box, you get DC Multiverse, the Flash. For the left side of the box, you get DC the Flash, the Flash. Bat costume, the Flash. Make Farland toys for the back of the box. You get the sick artwork of the Flash wearing the bat costume. Then in the right corner, you get McFarland toys. Then in the left corner, you get the Flash. The Flash, but now let's crack this thing open. And here is the Flash's accessories, and these are reused. And they got the color wrong. The Flash's accessories are not yellow in the movie, they are blue for the bat suit one. But these are completely reused from the Justice Lead Flash. But now let's take a closer look at the Flash. And here is the Flash outside the box. But now let's take a closer look at him. Starting off with the face. And I don't know why on my figure. I got some like black paint in between the lips. With a black dot on his cheek. But now let's talk about the cow. And yeah as you can see. It's done in like a dark maroon color. And as you can see in the movie, he has cut off the bat ears. And he is like wearing some Speed Force headphone things. But they have some black paint on the side of them. And some black paint on the back of it. Then going back to his face. For some weird reason, on mine, the eyes are off-centered. As you can see. But then going down to the torso area. We get the sculpted Batman logo with the spray painted Flash logo on top. Then you get some sculpted lines at the pec area. Then going down to like the stomach area. You get some more sculpted detail with some black paint in there. Then just, I think this suit is the Batman Returns suit because the stomach piece right here. Then going down to his belt thing area i don't know what this is exactly called but it is done in a yellow paint and it has black lines all the way around on it then going to the arms there's some black paint at the shoulder area with some like sculpted lines throughout it then going to the glove the gloves area gloves slash hand area you get some sculpted detail on them then going to the elbow area you get some sculpted detail in the corner of them. Then going to his leg area, you get some sculpted lines in the front and the side. And there's some black paint on the side of the flash. Then going to the knee area, you get some more knee pads at the knee area. But you get some sculpted detail on the side of them. Then going down to the shin area, you get some more sculpted detail. Then you get the Flash logo painted on the side of the shin area. Then the back of the calf is painted black with some sculpted lines in there. Then there's some sculpted detail on the back of the Flash. Then going to his feet, there's some more black paint on them. Then for the bottom of his feet, he has peg holes. And that is it for looking at the Flash. And for his articulation... He looks that far down, looks that far up. He tilts that far to the right, tilts that far to the left. He looks that far to the right, looks that far to the left. He can do a 360, or his head anyways can do a 360. His arms go that far out. His arms can do a 360. You get arm swivel. You get double jointed elbows. Then you do get hand swivel, but it's kind of like stiff on the peg. You get hand swivel though. The hands go that far in, if I can get it. They go that far in. They go that far out. Then for the diaphragm, it goes that far back. Goes that far forward. You get swivel. It tilts that far to the right. If I can get it, it tilts that far to the left. Then you get waist swivel a little. 
then the waist tilts that far to the right and tilts that far to the left then it goes that far forward and goes that far back then for his legs he kicks that far forward kicks that far back and he can do the splits god dang then for his knees he has double jointed knees then for his feet he has ankle swivel and he has foot swivel if i can get it he does have foot swivel i just can't get it to move but his toe joint goes that far up then his feet can go that far back or down then that far up now is it for his articulation and here's the flash wearing the bat suit next to the dark flash and the ben affleck batman and here is the flash wearing the bat suit next to the target exclusive unmasked batman and the regular released masked batman and this is obviously the return suit right i'll pop a picture up of it right here and here is the flash wearing the bat suit next to the justice lead flash all right, guys, that's going to be it for this review today. I would appreciate if you guys hit the big red thumbs up button. Comment down below what figures you guys would want me to review next. And also, comment down below, what do you guys think about this Flash figure wearing the bat suit? Do you guys like it? Are you guys going to pick it up? Let me know down in the comments down below. But I'll see you guys next time.